and more. Crystal Rich joins us live with how you can get involved. Hi, Crystal. Good morning, ladies. So education is getting so advanced that kids are learning to code at a much younger age. And my favorite part about this camp is they use things that kids are already familiar with, Legos. I'm joined right now by Jeremy. Jeremy, Hi, good morning. tell me, good morning. Tell me what the students have built here. Well, they have a helicopter right here. And so they built this in about a day. And it has a brain that's connected to two motors and then a small motor that turns the uh, rotors. And so what we do is we build them and then we code them, which we use the computers, and you kind of code it really quickly or you can also use an iPad to control it. That's amazing. Now here, this is called... This is a rover. The rover. Guess who else has a rover, guys? Yeah, Mars <laughs> has a rover. And so we kind of use it a lot like the Mars rover in NASA where we have a rover and we attach attachments and sensors. This one's one of the kind of battle bots and you can kind of see all those over there have kind of the same uh, basic structure. And then they, we allow the kids to add on whatever they want to to kind of make it better and really test their engineering skills. I love it. Now look how young the coding starts. Good morning. What's your name? My name's Libby. Libby, what are you doing here? I'm coding. You're coding. Look at that. The coding starts so young. Now, over here is one of the helicopters. Hello there. What's your name? Uh, Sahab. Hi. So, show us how you control one of these helicopters. Uh, this is for moving it one way, and this is for the other way, and these are used to move the machine guns. So, can I show this to the camera? This is actually how they are making it spin. How amazing is that? Now, over here, this is one of my favorite stations. This is the epic battle that we saw a little bit earlier. They are going to rovers head to head, and they are controlling them through an app on iPads, on their cell phone. This guy right here is using an iPad. He is using a cell phone. And it looks like this young gentleman over here, who I'm going to kind of interrupt your battle, show us what you're doing to make make your car go? Oh, it's pretty simple. There's just a go button, um, a back button, and a right and left button, which make it turn. And this is an epic battle right now. You see, they have already lost wheels. The objective is to push one of the rovers out of the circle. So I'm joined by Sally, who um, helped put this program together. Where can students go if they want to sign up? Or where can their parents go if they want to sign up for this program? Head to the afterschoolacademies.com website. And um, you can find uh, where there are a number of um, camps that are still available in the morning or in the afternoon. And um, just call or uh, hit the email address for any questions as well. Perfect. Thank you so much. Stay with us. In the next hour, we'll show you some coding with these young kids. We'll send it back to you. They're so little. They are, they just give me so much hope. So much hope for the future. Aren't they incredible? They are cute. All right, Crystal. Thank